Uh, I've been here at Bang Gym about eight and a half years, going on nine years. First, man, I was just a big UFC fan, uh, watch fights all the time. Started doing, you know, little fights in my front yard, uh, called it YFC, Yard Fight Championships. And uh, I didn't really know what I was doing. I was finding myself in situations where, you know, I kind of get, kind of know something, but I'm not really sure what to do next. So I figured now it's the time to get to a gym, really start learning some things. And, our first class starts, it's from four to seven. It's our little dragons class. Me and Danny Shell was teaching the class. It's really just to teach them how to pay attention, listen, follow instructions. And so we had two of our top students, which was uh, Spark Plug and Shotgun Shell, you know, little shotgun. And I know with uh, my instructor, he told me that I would get better when I started instructing other people, and I have. So we started bringing them up, incorporating them into a little dragons class. So now they're kind of like our junior instructors, and we have them running the four to seven girls class, and they're doing a great job with it. So. Man, I went to my first MMA fight at the FedEx Forum, and I met these guys from Bang, man. It was real cool, and they invited me to come down. So uh, once I finished school and everything, I come straight here uh, first day, and uh, they treated me like family, dude. I never left. I think everybody should have a goal. Uh, several goals and then the ultimate dream. Uh, my ultimate dream is just to be a successful martial artist later on in life, have my own school, making money, being able to change people's lives. But my ultimate goal is to, you know, make it in the UFC, make it as a fighter as well. I don't know, I can't really talk for other people who would motivate everybody else to come to this gym, but what really motivated me to come back after my first day was uh, a lot of these gyms have a lot of different students and I'll have very few instructors teaching a whole lot of the students. And I noticed right from my first day that this was kind of a small gym and uh, my instructor, Fred Fisher with Fisher's BJJ, he would if, if each individually go around to everybody on the mat and make sure they was doing it right. And if you wasn't doing it right, he'd be like, hey, you know, that's wrong. And show you the right way to do it. You know, he was never gonna lie to anybody, say, you know, oh, it looks good, you got it. If it's crap, he told you it was crap. And uh, he was able to focus on everybody and not, you know, just kind of get you there, you know? So I felt like each individual person had their attention. <laughs>